script that I'm blanking on right now. Most emotionally attached to game. Most emotionally attached to game. So all the way back to your Pong, to that good old Atari. <laughs> Dude, I had Pong when I was younger. Did you really? Uh huh. My, my, my I used to play my mom. <laughs> she always beat me though, so I was like, I hate this. Just game. Like, I, I don't want to play this game with you, mom. But yeah. You know, Dude, that, that's freaking weird. You got those little, like, things. Those sticks? Mm-hmm. And I was like, dunk, dunk, dunk. What's your... old freaking round TV. is freaking... Back in the day, those 240p. Yeah. <laughs> Where are my bees at, man? <laughs> Dude, I got 720 all day long. More of a 610 guy, so... <laughs> Dude, all right. No, like, just... So do you, have, do you have any emotionally attached games? I mean, you probably guess mine. No. It's Pong? <laughs> no. Probably the Link games. Zelda, Zelda games. Yeah. Really like those. Just because I think it's just nostalgia. And I can always like go back on them. Go back on them and have a good time with them. Yeah. Cause, and, and I just like open worlds. Like, uh, Ocarina of Time was probably like my top game until Majora's Mask when I was younger. Because I was a little bit older when I could play Majora's Mask. I actually could beat the game. Understand how it's Yeah, I was like, days. dude, I, I always got to the Water Temple on Ocarina of Time. I was like, screw this game, I quit. It's tough work, man. But, yeah, it's probably the best. I, I always enjoyed those games just because they're just open world. Yeah. And it's just fun gameplay, just slicing and dicing. So it's Karate nostalgia. Chopping. Yeah, nostalgia is probably the bigger, biggest factor. Yeah. Thank you for this question, it's probably nostalgia. Unless, I got you. unless it's like later in life and you just really fell in love with the game. Trying to what think. about you? Some rant. For me, it's the randomest. The Need for Speed games. Really? Midnight Club Dove Edition. The Uncharted. I don't know. Some about all those games. Even Crazy Taxi. The older stuff. <laughs> just makes me just. Oh, wish I was a kid again playing Crazy Taxi on my Sega Dreamcast. You know Sega Dreamcast? Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. <laughs> Played some Shinmu. You ever heard of Shinmu? No. Oh, check it out. Did he have a... Excuse me. Pardon me. Did he have a... Um, Sega... Whatever you call those. What's that game? With the block in the middle? Dreamcast. They said, yeah, Sega Oh, yeah, okay. I thought you said Sega Genesis. God no, damn it. No, Dreamcast. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, dude, that, dude, that console's awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the weird controllers where it's like gray. Yeah. yeah. And they showed the play in the middle for like the. Like Soul Calibur, I remember playing Soul Calibur on it. Yeah. Mm hmm. Good time. Link was on that game. Really? Yeah. On the Xbox. They like added it for him. He's a sword guy. Very, very interesting. Very, very the, interesting. So, wait. Need for Speed just because you want to be younger again? Little kid going to my neighbor's house every day just playing Need for Speed. Mm hmm. Back in simpler times, oh yeah. All you did was go home, play some video games, oh, yeah. eat dinner, be like, no, I gotta maybe do some homework. Yeah, you gotta get a job, deal with other people. Get that some, insurance. You know, get some car payments paid. You're like, yeah, I don't want to do that anymore. I'm done being an adult. I'm going to play my Need for Speeds. I'm just going to make YouTube videos all day. But I guess <laughs> I've heard of people saying, like, being emotionally attached in a way where you're like, let's say you're going through a breakup or something. There's a game you always play to get you through it. I've never experienced that. Have you experienced anything like that? Boredom. Uh, then I didn't want to really do anything, so I played WoW. <laughs> I think that's where everybody plays WoW. Uh, like, I remember me and my buddy always just went home. and We just played it, like, we got home at 4, and then just played it, like, till 10.30 or 11, and just passed out. And then, like, the next day, we'd always just talk about it in gym. Yeah. And like while we're lifting weights, we just like talked about it. Oh, buddy. Trent. Trent. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's all we. That's all we did. That's all you guys I, did. That was like my life for like three years. That's all I did. Sounds like three good years, honestly. It was a good time. I guess I just, all caught for. Yeah, that freaking. That game's awesome. I never got into that, but. Trent did. Everyone, yeah, Trent did. Lock collar or whatever his Xbox. Lock collar. Is that how you said it? I think so. I've always it's wanted. L O K. H O L A R, Lock Hollow. Yeah, I think so. And then, and then he went to um, Rabbit Mongoose too. That's a good one. And we played Modern Warfare. Dude, Modern Warfare Two is good though. First one, so much better. Well, yeah. I mean, I I think it's just because you uh, you played it at the start. I cried like two weeks in that game. It was the best 
that. Yeah, because he always told me about freaking you guys, you and Eric always just went downstairs. Just and in my basement. He had his own TV. I had my TV just all night, man. That's what we need to be like. We need to get back to those days. <laughs> Never happened. Like we need to make those days happen. That's how it was. I always played, I think during that time, I was playing probably Halo 3. Sounds about right, yeah. Because I just played, dude. I had this freaking oh. free, X, free month of Xbox Live. I just was going to town on it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Co-host, what are some other topics? Send me up the topics. All right, so what game? Any game you want. Doesn't matter. Nintendo game. Go back to that Atari. Gen- Atari. You got that Genesis. You got X. You can go even go just Xbox 360. Whatever game you want. What game do you want? Like remade. So it's like pristine remade. Like think of like beautiful engine, like Killzone. Like that. I think that's a pretty game. Okay. Re- they remastered the whole thing. That freaking remasters are stupid. Cause they don't, they don't do, they don't do anything. Uh-huh. Cause they just like look like they just like, oh, here's some more polygons and whatever. Yeah. What what game do you want for PS4 slash Xbox One? All right, here's one that's going to be unpopular. Well, it's gonna be eh, COD Four. If you give me, oh my gosh, <laughs> give, I would put a month into that game. Cause I still remember all the maps. I remember the best oh, yeah. guns. Don't, I remember don't the they spawns. recycle the maps? Did they recycle? I think they recycle. No, there's one. They, like, they add, redid it. For Advanced Warfare, if you pre-order the like, deluxe edition, you got one pipeline. You got pipeline to Modern Warfare. That's that's interesting. If I that's if they say, hey, we're releasing all these maps in the same guns. Oh my god. You you scored oh out. Would you get like a deluxe edition? I would get the probably not. I don't. I get, get the hundred. I want to get like the two hundred. I get the. Okay, you get the hundred buck one with like a collect like collector stuff. God yeah. Stuff. In a heartbeat. That game defines Jesse Shepard in high school. They didn't even. Did they have a campaign to it? Mm-hmm. It was really good. Did you play the campaigns? Uh, I played the second one. That one's known for having the best. Second one. No. Or first one. What happened? Oh, you know. Spoilers. Never mind. <laughs> there is. I'm really interested though. There is one. Oh, it's the, you had to go. You were. Enemy territory, you and your partner, mm-hmm. and then you're in the field, and your partner goes, "Oh shit, duck!" And you go, "You go prone." He's like, "Don't move!" And like two minutes straight, enemy troops just march. You have to wait there for two minutes. Like they march in fields where you're laying, you see them just walking past you. You see a tank just drive by you. Is that like the setup for all that crap that's happened in the second one? Probably. I'd imagine it's the same. Soap. Yeah. Yep. We're. So at, yeah, at the end. The boat? He needs the boat for this. Yeah, thing. and you, you have the... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That, I need to... I'd, I'd, I'd buy that. Just because I don't like all the new game, Like all the new Call of Duty games. I'd replay. I oh, God, yeah. I don't know how people are so addicted to those, dude. I think Everyone's I, on the boat where they're like, this game's going down. No one goes. likes this. It never goes down. Though. Yeah, no. it's, going, it's going down. People Unless like me are the reason it keeps staying up. Because I'm like, I fucking... Call of Duty sucks, and then September rolls around. I'm like, you didn't buy the last one though. Yeah, I did. Advanced oh Warfare. Gosh. Kevin Spacey in the campaign? Are you kidding me? I'm playing that campaign. That was the campaign any good? Fantastic campaign, yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I had no interest. I was like, I don't want to see any books. I was like, Kevin Spacey. Buying. Kevin Spacey, say no more. You're my guy. That's crazy. Oh, That's what crazy. about you? Hmm. I'd like. This is gonna be a. This is gonna be a little curveball for you. Okay. Yeah, I know something. Super Smash Brothers for the N64. All the same stuff. Updated graphics. Plays the same. Just looks... All levels look so much better. More levels and stuff, too. That's what game I want to remade. Just get it for the Wii U. No, it's not the same. It's never the same. It's not the same. It's they, never they, the they, same. They, they fudged it up, Jesse. They, did they fudged it up after the, the first one. Okay. And that might just be because I have nostalgia to it again. But... I think that's our reason for every answer. It's nostalgia. You gotta get that... But at the same time, I don't, I don't. There's too many. There's too many people, and the, it turned into like, I don't know. A lot of, a lot of people don't like the older ones, like the olds, like N64 ones. Isn't that the best one? A lot of people don't like it. Oh no! Isn't uh, Brawl like the most popular? Mm-hmm. Game people game? like that the best, I think. But I'm like, ah. no, that's not GameCube. That's oh, the Wii. I thought the, the Melee is popular. Melee is. I was always. I like GameCube Melee too. One. Melee, the GameCube one is the most popular. I like Melee. They said Brawl was eh. Yeah. And I don't know. I never played the new one. It looks cool. I just don't have anybody that likes Nintendo that much and then get, buys a Wii U. True. I guess you did, but you kind of got rid of it. I got rid of it for next one. I was like, yeah. 
You always came, I always came over and you're just like, just can you play some? We played actually Mario Kart, that's fun. It's, that's what, that's what sucks. You realize when you're in college, you're like, I'm buying a Wii with me and my friends. My friends are going to come over, we're going to play it. I get the Wii, I'm like, oh shit. My friends are busy now. We mm. can't just, I'm like, I'm mm. not going to play this by myself. Yeah, dude. Freaking, I, like, that's why N64s are so, like, are so popular in, like, college yeah. and stuff. Because you just, like, yeah, the door. It's, it, they freaking, yeah. You yeah. just in Goldeneye. Dude. Goldeneye is awesome. Alright, here's, I'll give you an older remake. Uh... I was gonna say Crazy Taxi, of course. Charge twenty or thirty bucks for it. I play it. Mm-hmm. Uh. I mean, I thought the Call of Duty one was fine. I never played it, so I'd like. I I like, dig that. It's so. Good. Um. I'd definitely buy that for sure. What would I want remade? I don't know. As a little kid, I always played racing games and smaller things like that. Maybe a uh, oh. Gran Turismo. Army Men. Is that the one on sixty four? Sarge's Heroes. Yeah, dude, that's a good game. I don't think I got a good review though, but that was a good game. Yeah, I remember that was a hard, dude. As a kid, I was playing that with my friends. Dude. I did on Dreamcast too, actually. Oh, it was on Dreamcast? I had 64. I had, it was on both. It was it the same game? I don't think so. So they made more than one. Was it the next one? Dude, that was a good, and then you had the multiplayer? The best, that was the best, yeah. That, dude, that had a good, I had like a so, it was a so long story. I, I don't think I ever beat it. I was only play. I had friends that were just playing like that. I distinctly remember one level, and it freaking sucked. Uh, granted you grant you I have I only had like I was only like probably 10 or 12 that's the it's so hard to understand stuff back then I'm like, like I don't get this I like I always watched my brother play and I was like man he's I think I think my brother beat it and I just watched him but I don't remember how it went but dude that game it's a good game NBA good Street game. I played the I, I, I played a little bit of that I didn't like NFL Street I loved NBA Street that was my thing. the NFL Blitz you were playing that game that was a good for PS2 uh, there's 64 too. I have 64 too, yeah. <laughs>